place where the land may see There is a home so sweet, the house of an artist With something to show us, painting pictures of brush and pen Up on the paper in a book that's so beautiful It is a joy to read because the stories you find in this book of wonders Are some of the most amazing you will hear For the stories were inspired over the ages By God's Holy Spirit, you guided your tritus long ago John is the friar's name, and you will find with him Three friends so special, having fun all together Renata, Leopold and Tim, who want to share with you All the good stories that the friar John would tell And if you like, you can join these four friends And maybe stay for a while, and together we will play Or perhaps you would like to join in the chorus No need to worry if they sing a little out of tune If you prefer to play it you can enter too. So come, we are waiting in this holy place. We're really sure that you want to hear the stories of our John. The Unmerciful Servant. Timothy. But you can lend me a few, can't you? Come on. Okay, so long as you only use the ones that don't need. Oh, goody, goody. Okay, let's see. This little piece. Oh, this one. No, not this one. Oh, okay, this is the one I want. Do you need this one, Leopold? What? Um, that one? Um, no, I don't think I need that one. Good. I'm good for this. Yes. And, and do you need this long piece? This piece? Yes. But only this yes, one, eh? Yes. Yes, well, take it. Yes. Okay, thank you. Oh, this is great. <laughs> <laughs> It's being oh, used, sorry. It's just that I need one that is bigger. But this piece holds up the entire castle. You can't take it out, Tim. Besides, I have to put one over here. Oh, too bad, because I need it. Look, it's gone. What will happen if I take it? Let's see. Push a little. Nothing happens. Push a little bit more. Nothing happens. I think I can bear it. <laughs> Let's see, I'm going to take it. Oh,
this piece here and my castle is finished. Oh, what happened? My castle has been broken. Why? Why? What's happened to it? I think I know who is to blame. Timothy! What is my little piece doing here? I told you don't take out the piece. It's an accident. Forgive me. Not forgive me. I said no. Renata, Who's oh dear, I'm sorry, my... it was me, but it was sorry, an accident. Sorry, nothing. What? How would you like someone to spoil your day's work? All day? All day to do that, Renata? Ha! Huh. Now you say you haven't done anything wrong. Uh, See if you like it when <coughs> someone does the same thing to you. Renata, this huh? toy was mine. Huh? T Timothy, I'm sorry, I didn't Tell me know. nothing. Huh? You should have asked before you did it. I didn't know it was yours. I was so angry and, and it was his fault because he made my me fault. mad. Yes, your it fault. It was Timothy's fault. He destroyed my castle. I was building it. It was your fault because you didn't want to share the pieces and I had to oh, take one away. Oh. These, these pieces are mine and I will lend them no, to you when no. I want to. Oh, this ruler is mine. Let it go. It's Give mine. it to me. No. Give me that toy. This is mine. I it's heard. mine, ruler. I heard. It's it's mine. Mine. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Look what you've done, oh, Renata. What, what are we going to do, huh? Done. Oh, here comes Father John. What have we done? Children? Huh? Is there anyone here? Oh, my paint. How could this have happened? Children? Where are you? What a disaster. Hello, oh, Timothy. Oh, hi, 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 hi. Let's see. Explain to me what happened. Okay. Okay, so what happened? When we had a fight, uh, it's, it's just that we were fighting John. with my ruler because we were all fighting. Yes, Father John, John forgive, forgive us, us because I was fighting yes, we with Renata and not doing the painting. Don't worry about oh, that. Excuse, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Why are we not fighting? Because, yes, because so I took it without permission. That's a lie because it's the true. pieces are mine and I have no reason but to do it. But says that the ruler is yours, but it's mine. But I didn't know the ruler was Renata's and besides, Timothy took it. Okay, okay. I see you've offended each other. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes, Leopold offended me. Me? Yes, well, I was Timothy offended me. Well, Timothy offended me because she threw my mm, toy yes. on the floor. Well, you see, if you've offended each other, you also need to forgive each other. But, but I asked mm. Timothy to forgive me and he didn't mm. want mm. to forgive me. Uh, well, what about me? You didn't forgive me well, either. I asked you to forgive me and you didn't forgive mm. me. You didn't you're want to forgive me. You're lying. That's enough. Oh, you're lying. Can't you forgive no, if no, I've no. forgiven you? Hmm. To be forgiven, huh? you must learn to forgive. Uh -huh. hmm. yeah. Yes, there's a parable that speaks hmm. about it. <gasps> a yes. Oh, good. A well, parable. you want to read a it? Parable. Come on. Oh, wow. It's the parable of the unmerciful servant. The unmerciful servant. Oh, without a heart. Oh, without a heart. There was once a king who wanted to see how his servants were managing his money. When he looked at the accounts, he saw that one servant owed him 10,000 talents. I imagine you know how much you owe me, don't you? Uh, oh, uh, I know it's a lot. I'm not sure, really. How much is it? Hmm. 10,000 talents. How will you pay me? Do you have that much money? No, Your Highness, I don't have the money. Uh, but given time, I'm sure I can pay it all back. Mm -hmm. You don't have the money. Hmm. Hmm. Guards! <coughs> Sell this man as a slave and his wife and children too. <coughs> no, Sell his no, house no, and his land. No. No. And all his possessions no, no. and use the money to Be pay merciful, the debt. please. As you wish, my lord. No, no, please be merciful. Oh, no, not my family. Oh, no, please, not my family. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, 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 oh. And the king, who had a good heart. I will be merciful to you. I forgive you. You may go free. Release him. 
Your debt is cancelled. Majesty, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, you are truly a merciful king. Oh, thank you. Oh, I'm, I'm free. I'm calm free. Oh, down, thank you. Thank you, my king. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh, I'm free. I'm free. I'm a free man. Oh, I'm free. I'm free. I'm a free man. Oh, I'm free. I'm free. Oh. The servant left the palace feeling very happy and walked out into the street. And there he met a man he knew, another servant, who owed him only one hundred denarii. Aha! There you are! So where's my money? Pay me what you owe me! Well, I'm short of cash. I've had some problems recently. I just can't pay you. That's just an excuse. Pay up right now or I'll take you to the judge and make sure he sends you to jail. Understand? Please give me time. I'll pay you back. I've given you plenty of time, and I should have done this a lot sooner. Guards, now you'll see. Yes, sir. Arrest this man. He owes me 100 denarii and won't pay me back. Take him to the judge. No, 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 please. But although the man begged for mercy, it was no use. The servant took him to court, and the judge sentenced him to be held in prison until the 100 denarii had been repaid. The king heard all this and was very angry. <gasps> it can't be true. He had this man sent to jail because he owed him 100 denarii? That's right, sire. Bring me that unmerciful servant. <coughs> you are a wicked man. I cancelled your debt because you begged me to. Shouldn't you do the same and forgive your fellow servant in the same way I forgave you? Take this man to prison and don't let him out until he's paid back everything he owes. See, God is like this king. Oh, why is God like that king? Because God forgives us like this king, but he wants us to forgive others. Yes, oh. and if we don't forgive, are we going to prison? Well, not exactly. But if we don't forgive, we will live in darkness and in the prison the of bitterness. The oh, prison of the darkness, darkness and bitterness. Oh, I feel I've been in the darkness and prison of bitterness for a while, for not forgiving Timothy. I'm going to forgive Tim. Oh, thank you, Leopold. Thanks. That's well done, Leopold. Oh. Timothy, I forgive you for collapsing my castle. I forgive you even if you destroyed it by removing a piece <gasps> cold and calculated, taking Ooh. advantage I wasn't there. It was the reason my beautiful castle fell down. I worked so hard, it's your fault, you inconsiderate tiny Leopold, man. Leopold, <laughs> please, but I'm going to forgive him. Father John, I think it's going to be very hard to forgive him for this offence. Yes, I will have to wait too before I forgive Leopold for destroying my drawing. And I will have to wait a long time before I forget that Leopold called me inconsiderate and a tiny mouse. Well, try to forgive him so you don't live in the darkness of bitterness. I will try, but I don't think I can. Father John, it's, dark in it's here. very dark. Yes, I think there will be a storm. A storm? Yes. Oh, a light. Oh, oh, Father John, it's happening. Happening. It's nice it will end soon. Oh, it's calm. Oh, Father John, it's very dark. Father John, I'm afraid. Me too, Father John. Timothy, it's just a storm. I'm afraid. It's 
Stay calm, Timothy. It will be finished in a moment, don't worry. It's only a storm. We're this afraid, Father John. This isn't a dice about forgiveness, mm. but everything is very mm. dark. Oh. It's very dark. In the darkness, a little light. Oh. 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 oh, I like that. Yeah, yeah, nice. A light. That's and if better. you want, while the storm finishes, mm. huh? we can listen oh. to the music box. Oh, 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 the music, music box. The music box. Oh, yeah. Oh, open it, Timothy. Open it, open it. Come on, let's see what's inside. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, it's a king sitting on a throne. Oh, it's a good king. There's a door. Oh, and there's a man locked up. Here is a prison. It's a prison. The king looks very grand. Look. He's asking the king, look. Oh, I like that. Let's see. It's really Strict and severe, so his servants that had grown, and it was clear it was now ten thousand talents of gold, and the poor man had not a penny to hold. So the king ordered the sale of his home, his belongings, and everything else that he owned, and sell his wife and kids to be slaves. I will have my money, I need to be paid. That poor servant soon begged in desperation, Please forgive me, he cried, or oh, have compassion. The king felt sorry for this man, so forgave the dead and let him start. Over again, let us not forget the pardon God gives us when there are others causing us offense. Don't ever end up bearing grudges, there's a life to live. And if someone does offend us, let us forgive. <laughs> To dancing, very happy. Then an unexpected meeting. Who should he see? A man who owed him money, just a little, and could not pay him any. Not a nickel. Pay me now what you owe me, he demanded. Or a prisoner you will be. You'll get arrested. Although the debtor begged, all in vain. Before the judge, he was laid. Shackled in chains. The news came to the king at the palace and ordered the man brought in. In disgrace. Your debts have all been covered. Count close. So couldn't you forgive another? The little oath. Now off to jail you go for your evil, and you won't be free to go until you paid it all. Now off to jail you go for your evil, and, and you won't be free to go till you paid it all. Let us not forget the pardon God gives us when there are others causing us offense. Don't ever end up bearing grudges. There's a life to live, and if someone does offend us. See, children, we must forgive. Mm. Yes, it's true. Mm. We should forgive. Though we yes, were fighting. Yes, it's true. We should forgive. Leopold, yes. Could, mm. could you forgive mm. me because I mm. took out the piece and collapsed mm. your castle? Yes, Timothy, I forgive you. And can you forgive me for calling you an inconsiderate yeah. and tiny I mouse? Forgive Come you. here. I forgive you. I love you, oh, Timothy. I love you. Renata. Can yes. you forgive me for having damaged the drawing and for the fight? I'm really oh, sorry. Of course I forgive you, You're my you, best Leopold. friend, Renata. I love I you. Love you. Forgive beautiful. me for being angry. Oh. Hey, Timothy. Oh, yeah. Do you forgive mm. me for knocking down your toy and breaking mm. it? Oh, yes, Renata, mm. I forgive you. Mm. Oh, thank you very mm. much, I Timothy. Love you, Come Renata. on, you two, give me a hug. I love you very I'm much. I'm happy now you forgave too. each other. Look, a rainbow. Oh, a rainbow. How pretty. 
It's as if we've made God happy because we have forgiven each other. Yes, you feel better when you forgive and you let others yes, forgive you. Yes, it takes yes. a lot of weight off me, but it costs a oh, lot. Yes, yes, there was once great. a saint <gasps> oh, who forgave for something on, come really, on. really Yay. hard. Well, come let's on. go, let's go. His name was Saint John Gualbert. Oh, oh. Saint, saint John, John Gualbert. <laughs> John Gualbert was born in Florence, Italy, in the 11th century. He was of a noble family and his father intended him to have an important position. It happened that his only brother was killed. One day, as he travelled along with some military friends, he suddenly found the murder of his brother and he cornered him. The murderer thought himself lost. He begged for his life, making the sign of the cross with his hands. Struggling against his heart, which called for revenge, John Gualbert had mercy on him and forgave him. He let him go, saying, For the love of Christ, I forgive you. After this encounter, he went to a church and knelt before an image of Christ crucified. Then he saw that Jesus tilted his head and told him, Thank you, John. From that moment, his life changed completely. In reward for his good deed, Jesus gave him the desire to be a monk. He left the weapons and military uniforms and became a humble monk, full of peace and joy, but also of strength and righteousness. As a monk, he did great good for the church because he corrected those who made money with the religious life and founded many monasteries in which they lived in righteousness and in holiness. Oh, lovely! Yay. Good! Oh, and wow. so, from the saint who forgave something as difficult oh. to forgive as the murder of his only brother, we can learn there isn't anything impossible to forgive. And if we forgive, God is very happy and he blesses us very much. What do you think? This saint forgave such a hard thing and I could not forgive the breaking of a toy castle. And I could not forgive the spoiling of a little drawing. But finally, you found you could forgive, and that's the most important thing. Yes. We'll often offend and upset each other because we're still sinners. But without forgiveness, we would be angry all the time. Would you like that? No, 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 no. no. It's much better if we're always happy. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I love you. Well, would you like to sing the song of the unmerciful servant? Oh, yes, come on, let's sing the song. Oh, yes, 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 come on. Another. No, off to jail you go. Oh, you're evil. And you won't be free to go. Oh, 
touches there's a 